Well, today in Knoxville, the first time this is happening, St. George Greek Orthodox Church brings a tradition to East Tennessee. The church blesses the waters with a cross. 10 News reporter Krista Lucas explains how this tradition is becoming a part of the community. Yes, Mary, today, today is the day of the feast day of St. John the Baptist. The tradition is that after the morning ceremony, the church and everyone follows the priest who blesses the waters. It was cold and it was raining, but Father Dionysios Lambropoulos left St. George Greek Orthodox Church to throw the cross in the Tennessee River. It is a tradition in Orthodox countries to go and bless big water bodies like seas, rivers, lakes. He tied the cross with a thin rope and threw it in the water three times signifies the Trinitarian God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. A melted image. The church faced some challenges after a fire destroyed the main sanctuary years ago. Father Anthony Stratis says they still pushed on. We set up a chapel in our hall. He says this church welcomes everyone. Coming here, and especially somebody with, with, with Parkinson's, coming here, it, 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 it was like revi very revitalized my, my ministry because even with Parkinson's and all that, the people were very understanding with that. For some younger generations, it's the first time ever seeing the cross in the water. I loved it. I thought it was really pretty to see how he was like blessing everything. A parent says it's an experience she shared with her daughter. So it's very important to bring my daughter with me today to have us experience this wonderful blessing of the water. Father Dionysios says he hopes the blessing flows through the river for everyone. A great saint of the Orthodox Church said once, acquire the spirit of peace and a thousand people will be saved around you. Well, Krista, you've seen this tradition back in Greece and we're talking about how geography may affect some traditions. Yes, Mary. Well, usually in Greece, there are divers who jump in the water to catch the cross. This is considered good luck and a huge blessing for whoever brings it back to the priest. And Today, it was a little bit too cold, so maybe next year somebody will dive in and catch the cross. Hopefully so. I know I wouldn't do it today out there. It's cold. Thank you so much, Krissa.